God doesn't love us for just an hour or two once a week. So if church exists to help us feel closer to Him, it needs to be bigger than a Sunday service. What if believers didn't just form a congregation? What if they formed an extended family of faith? So no matter where Mormons live, and they live all around the globe, one thing remains constant. Every member of the church belongs to a local group of believers called a ward. Here's the Relief Society, and every ward has one, and together they form one of the largest women's organizations in the world. Tonight, it looks like they're putting together care packages for neighbors in need. It's not easy being a teenager these days, so every ward has a strong youth program to reinforce values and to let the kids know they're not alone. Looks like someone needed some help moving. Oh, must be Monday, time for family night at home. Tomorrow, neighborhood party, and it looks like everyone's invited. Sunday, the ward meets together, but there's no paid clergy. Everyone volunteers their time. That includes duties in the church, and service projects around the community, or just dropping in to say hello. It's what Jesus Christ did, and that's why it's what Mormons do, wherever they are, all over the world.